Hello, and welcome to Stunt Rally. I'm Mr. X, the world champion and owner of Stunt Island. If you need help, move the hand pointer over something on the screen, then I'll tell you what it does. Hey guys, yes, boy, C66 here, and today I'm doing another Let's Play. Oh my gosh, golly. This time, it's a Lego Stunt Rally. I used to play this game as a lot of, a lot as a kid, and uh, I'm pretty excited to be playing it again. So over here we got uh, Mr. X, and uh, yes, you can turn him off. If you need help in the future. Uh, just yes, click that, on that's the a feature. I'm turning, I'm that, turning, that's the turning me off. feature in the game. Oh, I'll keep well, him on, I'm so back. just to annoy your ears. Alright, let's go into the championship. Welcome to the Stunt Island map. This is where you choose your races in the Stunt Rally Championship. You must win all of the races in the four different areas before you can race against me to become world champion. To start your first race, just click on the flashing marker. So yes, this is world map. Uh, I didn't know that the earth looks like this. Uh, flat earthers. Uh, you can argue in the comments, but anyway. We got Chip. This is where you your character. French. Click on the blue oh. race button. And my personal favorite. I want to start Barney. This is the workshop where you choose your car and tires. Click on the blue race button when you are happy with your car selection. Click here to change your car tires. You can see that when you choose different tires, the car's top speed and grip indicators will change. Click this here to continue. Good. This is where we look at. Oh. This is where we look at who is competing in the race. Right, here's, uh, here's a funny robot. Anyway, let's race. This is where. <coughs> what? Uh, hopefully, I don't lose. Throughout the series, you will hear a lot of me breaking and you making that noise. Uh, yeah, if you don't break, then you kind of spin out like that, which is very cool of the game. So, uh, while this might be annoying, this is a, uh, this is optimal, optimal gameplay right here. Very, very enthralling race course we have here. Some nice, uh, nice turns and a good old ramp at the end, yes. Um, we are absolutely demolishing a stupid robot. These humans are obviously better at racing than robots, of course. There you go. There's our first race done. Congratulations, you won a brand new car. You won a new car. Very cool. No! Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey! Thank you, Barney. Very cool. Congratulations, you've won a race. I've won a race. Click on the flashing marker to I select. I think I'll do this one now. Oh. Click here to. This is where we look at and who is competing in the Sandy. race. Sandy? I guess we'll say Sandy. Oh. Click here oh. to continue. I can hear the big crunch. This is. In these audio files, but that's okay. <clears throat> and here we go. As you can see, uh, the story mode campaign adds more and more like race pieces to the tracks. For instance, we got this loop de loop. Is a uh, very silly, but who cares? It's a, who cares? It's a game for children. Who cares? It it doesn't have to make any sense, okay? You know. Yeah, like I said before, uh, I used to play this game a lot as a kid. The one aspect of this game is you can make your own racetracks. 
and boy howdy, I spent hours and hours and hours taking my own really crazy and wacky courses. So that many people do that once we finish the story mode, since you unlock more and more pieces. For instance, I think we will unlock this loopy loop once we finish this course. Seems like a thing that would happen since we unlocked the car last round. Yeah. Congratulations, you've won these fabulous prizes. Fabulous prizes. No. Congratulations, you've won a race. Won the race. Yes. Click here to continue. This is where well, we, we got a who is emo guy. <clears throat> yeah. Or not emo, sorry, punk. He's a he's a huge punk. This is where. I don't know why it's an emo. <laughs> Oof. Are you okay there, game? Be lagging a bit there. And yeah, now it's nighttime. Wow. This game also has power ups. I can go super fast. I go very fast with very good particle effects coming out of my car and also the zero handling. Which is very cool. Let's see if I can get it again. Nice. Is this optimal? Well, see, it's tactical bomb, you know? I tell people I speedrun Mario Odyssey, right? I tell them I get the tactical box, you know? Tactical. Lots of fun to fall. Big race. Very easy, easy race. I gotta say. Congratulations, yes. you've won these fabulous, fabulous prizes. No. Congratulations, you've won. Hey, let's continue. Click <clears> here. <throat> this is where we oh, look Brad at. Speedo. <laughs> Classic Brad Speedo. This is where we. Get. Get out of my way! Slow down, slow down. Although there's a pit down there and hopefully I don't fall down there. Way too loud. These guys are pushing me! That it has to be illegal. Rap, where's the rap? I like that as well of the rap. Here there's um Yeah, there's those trucks and if you bump into them they the, uh, they spill strawberry jam everywhere. Ooh, almost onto the pit. That would have been good. Oof. Come on. I wanted to try and pop into him. <laughs> Just to see. Oof, on oh, the pit. Wow. I'm shocked. Game, please. Thing is, you control this. The main control scheme for this game is the ear keys, as you do. But uh, I see I walked into it. And uh, the ear keys on my laptop are very small, which is very cool. But if I fail, I'm gonna blame it on that. Congratulations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, Congratulations, I you've won a race. <clears throat> Click on the flashing marker to select the next race. Right now we got the quote unquote boss of the city. This is where we look at. Mm. Oh. Click is here to continue champion. on to the. This is. Well, hopefully, we won't lose. I probably shouldn't, because I'm. I'd like to think I'm pretty good at this game, anyway. There we go. The enters the... In order to use items, it's the enter key, but I keep pressing the wrong corner. Oh yeah, I just... I just bodied that truck. You guys, you all see that? I take that. That makes a funny noise when you go over the bumps. Yes. Let's so do that again. Ooh. 
Uh, hello? Yeah, I'll just put them on there. Why? Why does it cut off my speed power up when I use another one? Oh, I just went through the right- I just went right through the bosses. I don't know if that's intended, but, uh... Doesn't matter, because we won. Let's go. Congratulations, you've won these fabulous prizes. Well, we get an animation of the city of the champions I see you of being have big crybabies and become the city champion. Let's see if you can do just as well in the desert. Boy, no, this is the workshop. I don't want you your car. And my car. Click on the blue race button when you are happy with your car selection. Click here to choose a different car. Click here to change your... This is where we look at who is... Anyway, here we are in the desert. What kind of mechanics would be in the desert? Bonk. Bonk. Ow, that's cheating. That's actually cheating. You see what he did? That's, that's not fair at all. We have oil slicks. Please, Mr. Sir. Lap two. Tight, tight corners, tight turns. Oh, I, for I completely forgot you could do that. Wait, do I have a power up? I can, I can do a little horn. That's cool. Oh my gosh, please, game. Ouch. What if I just did that the whole game? That'd probably be very. They'd probably be even more annoying than uh, Barney, or Barney over here. Please stop the biggest. Mm. It's okay. Okay. Uh, cool. Easy peasy. Don't we? Congratulations, you've won a race. Click here. This is where we look at. Oh, the fans. Classic fans. Classic. If you guys haven't seen these fans, oh boy, are they pretty jank. They are. We have weird physics. And if you put like three fans next to each other, each one level higher, and uh, while you're building your own races, uh, that kind of just messes up the computer players because they don't know what to do. <laughs> There's a few ways you could cheese the AI and make them really confused in the construction editor. Which we'll probably take a look at once we're done. Wait, how am I? How am I in second? What am I doing? I'm I'm choking over here. I'm not giving it my game. So, where even is he? Did I get this power up? I got it. I don't know if it, I don't know if that helped that that much though. Come on, I gotta catch up. Come on. Nice. Oh, okay. I love it. Yeah, when you when you respawn, they kind of just go into the abyss, which is pretty funny. If you ask me. Should be good. Should I go? Uh, 
there go. Uh, oh, okay. Game. Game. Please. Congratulations, you've won this fantastic prize. Fantastic. You can now use this piece when you build your own tracks. No. Congratulations, you've won a race. Oh. Click here to... This is where... We've got Nighttime Desert, which I think actually looks pretty, pretty nice. Pretty nice relative to how the rest of the game looks. <laughs> I, I kind of, kind of like the look of this game. Game. The game was released in 2001, if I'm correct. Oh, it looks slightly outdated. I, I, I it holds up, I think, for the most part. It's got, it's, it's got a certain charm to it, you know, like the animations, you know, the characters, just a, just a wholesome game, I guess. Hey, anyway, uh, why is the track on fire? Uh, you know, don't ask me, uh, I still just don't think about it too hard, you know. So here we go, mud. And if you stand it too long, then you sink it. You sink it to the quicksand. No, that's, that's mud. They, I don't know why they didn't do quicksand. That's weird that they did mud, because I'm pretty sure it's I'm pretty sure it's mud in uh, all the other styles, being city, jungle, and uh, ice. Yeah, they should have done quicksand. I don't know. Miss opportunity. I'm a. Uh, Okay, this track has been pretty easy. Not really any competition. Bumps, yes, and we're done. Congratulations. You Congratulations, you've won a race. Click on the flag. Click here to continue. This is Ooh. where we look at who is competing. Have you come back for more radium? Have you, have you come? Have you come back for revenge after you lost to me like ten minutes ago? Please, please. This track has a lot of curves and fans. Apparently. Please don't use it. Please don't use it for me. That's cool. That's very cool. Oh yeah, there's that thing. It, it's a, it exists, I guess. I'm absolutely wrecking this course. Get the fan coming up. Yep. Nice tactical placement. Go, cool. I didn't want to fall to that pit. Voice lines and all the voice lines in this game, for that fact. Yeah, they kind of like tried searching up lines and couldn't find anything. I don't know. Anyway, we're we're getting we're getting close. We're getting ever so closer. Congratulations, you won the race. Finally, at Desert Champion. Click. This is where we look. Baron Flamboyant. <laughs> Click okay. here to continue. He, does he own all the oil? Is... He's the oil tycoon manager. That the that the lore of this game. I don't know. So why there's so much oil in the desert? I don't know. Cool. 
cool, very cool game. Pretty cool. We got some nice. See the mud. Another mud. Game. What are you doing? Oh, mud. Yes, yes, of course. What do you do? Oh, I wanted to grab it. I believe that's a shield power up. I think that protects you. It like puts a barrier around you, I'm pretty sure. I'll see if I see if I remember to grab it on the second third lap. Oof, that's a big yikes. Got it. Yeah, there's the barrier. That looks okay. I'll level up on the barrier just to secure us when you go into the loop de loop. But you know, that's okay. Don't, don't worry about it. Uh, game. 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 Oh, he's hot, he's hot on my tail. Hey, loop de loop. And we're done! Woohoo! Congratulations, you've Well done. I'm very impressed to see you have defeated the sneaky Baron Flambo. I think you're ready to try your luck in the jungle now. Well, that's all for me today, guys. If you liked, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. This is Gears Boy 66 signing out. Bye bye.